Babe of the day. Babe of the day. Whitney Blake. I like Whitney Blake a lot. She was sexy without even trying. She also played a lot of likable characters in TV and movies. Whitney looked really good in shorts. Perhaps her best known role is Dorothy Baxter, aka Missy, on the TV sitcom Hazel. TV moms don't get sexier than Whitney Blake. Plus, her Dorothy was a really good character. Whitney Blake is the real life mother of actress Meredith Baxter. Whitney Blake did a lot before Hazel, and she was good in everything she did. She played good girls. She played bad girls. She was in a lot of different uh, TV shows and movies. She did a few episodes of a TV show that I really like called State Trooper. Sort of an action cop show based on true crime stories. It starred Rod Cameron. Uh, she was in other shows like Sheriff of Cochise, uh, Johnny Midnight, Richard Diamond, Private Detective. She was in a Mike Hammer movie called My Gun is Quick. Uh, she did a lot of really quality work before Hazel, but when she got the role on Hazel, it really seemed to fit her. Because oddly enough, you know, as attractive as she is and sexy as she is and everything else, she just worked as a TV mom. I mean, she played a really good character. She was, and she was a believable TV mom that was attractive. Uh... Her and Don DeFore really worked well together. I mean, if you look at it, it doesn't seem like, you know, that that they would match up, you know, because, <laughs> but um, I'm a big Don DeFore fan too, by the way, but it just doesn't seem, but they played so well together, so you really did believe that they were man and wife. In real life, uh, she was a bit more what you would call liberal, liberal, you know, she was more democratic. And uh, Don DeFore was very Republican. <laughs> you know, she was against the Vietnam War. And uh, he was, you know, very, very Republican. <laughs> it just kind of drove him out. But other than that, I mean, I think they still had a good working relationship. You know, it just... I don't think it was anything that critical that would come to blows. Oh, her looking fancy in the fur coat. She could look sultry when she wanted to, but then also she played such, such bright, you know, nice characters. She had that ability where she could just switch it on or off. She could play, you know, somebody who was really seductive or somebody who was just really kind of nice and maybe naive. Thank you very much for watching this tribute to Whitney Blake. She's definitely, I think, one of the most appealing actresses Hollywood ever produced. Check out her work. She's definitely worth seeking out. And also, by the way, she's a co-creator of the One Day at a Time sitcom. Thank you very much.